Hey guys, welcome back to your daily serving of a long cactus. We've got some more room to grow here, a puzzle game about creating a longer and longer cactus to let us push a smaller cactus into its goal. And in this new area, we're confronted with a small cactus that's off the grid. Interesting. So we have to be able to set ourselves up and almost hook into it. But I can't just push myself like that. Because how do I grab the cactus? It's too late for me to turn around. So I need to almost set it up like such. So I will push it out. And now I will push it down. And then I would like to push it over however I can't because... What's gonna happen is that we're gonna hit the wall. So I need to actually set this up so that I'm taller. So now I've set it up so that we won't hit the barrier on our way over. A neat shape and a good puzzle. Let's carry on. Very large grid here. It seems that as the game goes on, the puzzles will be larger and larger in scale. How hard can this one be? Like, how hard is it to just simply push over? Oh, I can't push over to the right again because I'll get yelled at over here in the bottom right corner. So I got to almost push myself down first, twice. So I have room to get back in and then push over again using my long uh, tail. I don't know if it's appropriate to use the word tail to describe a cactus, but that's how I'm going to go with. Oh no, our cactus is caught on a corner. Well, why don't I just set this up? Push a left to go right but I'm blocking myself. What I could do is just try to get the cactus itself off the grid. So I, I built this wrong, like this. So now I'm covering the square, but maybe I could just push. Like see how it goes a bit? No, that kills it. I don't know why I expected my prickly body to be protective of that hole. So I gotta almost create a bit of a cradle here so I can knock it up like that. And then I'll go around the long way so I can push in the hole without uh, having myself destroy it. The cacti must coexist. Yeah, I think this game's just really, really, really nice. It'd be kind of cool if there were two cactuses at some point, but it seems they're just making us find interesting ways to shape our cactus instead, which is very good in its own way. So again, we have to push it to the left, but there's no grid line directly to the right of it. So we have to be, we have to set up a line here basically and push ourselves to the right twice. However, we know that will probably be an issue due to our base being in a bad place. Like if I just push over, tw you know, twice, it'll go once and then it won't go again. If I set this up and then go down, oh, wait. Oh, my base. I'm so close to being able to push that over. I just need to move my base. I need to move it down if I can help it. Oh, but then the left part gets stuck. It's so hard to describe this. The anatomy of the snake, I swear. What if I push down first to move my base that way? If I push here and then push again like this, and I could push one more time. No harm in that. Oh, I forgot I had... I would be pushing the cactus up that way. Oh, it's so close. We almost can do this. I hate giving up on that, but it feels like I fleshed it out. What about this? Huh. Wow, that was tricky. I don't even know how I really got into that. I just kind of was, I was trying to actually push it down in all honesty. Can I learn something from this? This was some tricky, tricky uh, puzzle solving here. I was trying to push it down, but I managed to find a way to be able to push it to the right. Can I even replicate it? So, I mean, like I looped around like such and I pushed it down, pushed down so that I had a vertical piece to the right of that. And then I was very easily able to push it over. Damn, that is tricky. I'm going to have to apply the idea to future levels, but I don't know if I'll be able to. Wow. Okay. Very cool. Very cool level. So the trick of this level is that there's very little space on which I can push myself off of. I mean, if I want to go up, there's only here. And if I want to go to the right, there's only here. And I can't even make myself go down or to the left. And I start here, so I immediately block this off. I can do this, but I mean, this, this always traps myself. There's nothing I can do here. So maybe I shouldn't worry about it. 
maybe what I should worry about is just kind of getting the base out of here. Like, really out of here like that? And then setting it up so I can send it up? That was easier. <laughs> <laughs> a lot easier than the previous puzzle, at least for me. Your mileage may vary. Level 23 time, then we have an important sign to read. Everything is so far away from the grid. Our cactus is going to put in a lot of work to get this done. There's no possible way I can push this cactus down, which means this cactus has to go here, and this cactus has to go here. As far as getting this cactus over, it's actually not too tricky, because all I need to do is push up my base like this, and then push over. That part's not so hard. The hard part is the cactus that's near me. I could try to send this over like such. And maybe, maybe that's just done it? That's not done it. Let me reset because almost what I want to do is create a longer piece like such. How does this work? A longer piece, piece like such. So then... No. What I want to do is push this into the section here, but I've trapped myself. Wait, maybe that's good enough? Yeah, actually, that's really good. Because that doesn't let the uh, currently rightmost cactus move. Wow, okay. Tough, tough puzzles. Telling us there's another cactus land ahead. Should have seen that coming. We beat the forest. Um, desert forest, I guess. Looks like... Well, there's two ways to go. There's a mountain line with 31 puzzles. Uh, before I do that, let's check out this plus down here. The forest plus. With probably some of the trickiest puzzles I'll see yet. Oh. There's cacti on the level screen. All right. <laughs> it has come to this. Oh, no, 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 no. I can't actually even reach the other levels, I don't think. I can't reach three and four unless I find a way to get myself there. Oh no. But you know what, let's, let's do... Wait, can I not do level... Sorry, I can do level one. I was pressing shift instead of enter. Hey guys, this reveal of overworld puzzles was so shocking, it made me change my shirt and the background changed. That's crazy. Anyways, let's try to solve this puzzle. One of the holes is so much farther away from the other. Uh, let's try to do it one at a time. Or maybe, oh, maybe I want to push this first over. Oh, then I can push one down, but I can't push the other one down. Ooh, can I push them both down at the same time here? Possibly? Here, let me reset to see if that's possible. Do something like this almost. But then I can't push this down first because I get stuck. So maybe if I push this all the way over first and then push it down, they would come down together and we'd get it in. Ooh, good start on the day. Oh, and as you beat a level, more of the map or more of the overworld becomes traversable. Well, what is level two in this unlock? Well, let's see. Interesting. I almost want to try something like this then. Use something like such to push it over and then push it over again. And if I was able to push down, now would be the time. But alas, what if I push it like this? No, I can't push it to the right. Or sorry, to the left. Start like this. I could push down first. What about this shape? I still want to push down, but now, hold on. I've created this shape. Oh, but my very first portion, like the very first portion of my, of my body prevents this from happening. Oh, that's so close. So close, but yet so far. And I can't send myself back to the right. Wait, hold on though. Maybe at the very end I could send myself, not not back to the right, but to the left. If I do that, I would just need to change the shape of this, like such. Wait, this is really close now. So push it over twice, push it down twice, and then push it to the left. Cool. These are definitely getting very tricky with the shapes, but I'm starting to kind of get the idea. We're going to level three now, and then shortly we'll be solving this overworld puzzle. Three cacti. Oh, boy. I don't know how much planning I'll need or if I really could just get away with gunning it. Oh, wait. This is weird. There's nothing to push off of. What in the hell? 
All right, well, I feel like I maybe want to start like this then, because I could then push around like such. And that's maybe close to getting this one in. Oh, yeah, there we go. That sets this elf up quite nicely. We have generated probably the most advanced cactus yet. Level four of the bonus section. There are places to push off of, but they seem to have strategical line removals. And it seems that the reason for that is so they just can't link up. What about some long line like this? If I push this whole thing down, I still can't push it over just because I don't have a way to be able to push left to go right. But that's closer? Well, hold on. What if I draw a line like this? And the reason why I'd want to do that is because now, if only I could push it to the left. Here's an idea. What if I create extra space here and then am able to... What if I push this whole thing over now? Yeah, if only I could push down then over. That'd be so perfect. So perfect. If only... I could just go into the wall. Although, how about from this position, I just push over one extra and then go down. Oh my gosh. No, I'm stuck. Wait a second then. It's only not possible because I drew this really weird shape at the beginning. Why would I need that shape? That doesn't make any sense to uh, shape out of. So I come down here and now I can push it over and make it in. Holy crap, that level was tricky. I don't remember why I did that, but I think there was a purpose for it in the first place. A purpose of a different idea that ultimately did not pan out. Let's get level 5, then let's try to solve the overworld puzzle. Alright, so we have to bring this to the left twice. So I'm going to start by making the shape that we're going to hook on it. So we grab it like this, and we bring it down like such. And then we just need to bring our entire being over. Well, hear me out. What if I do this instead? And now come down. And the reason why I can come down now is because I can push myself over once without ruining everything. Well, why don't I just do this? Well, for reasons. What if instead of pushing down, I actually push up? Like, I was thinking of hooking on it from the bottom, but that doesn't seem possible to set up. Can I ever start by pushing myself down? Because, yeah, I guess I could. This shape could possibly grab the cactus. If I push here, and then push up, I can now bring myself over twice? Almost. I can... No, not quite. This is always going to hit no matter what. <gasps> oh, my God. <laughs> I use this bend. I use this bend. Hold on. I push up here. I give myself space. I push up here. And then I push over twice. Holy crap. I was using the wrong bend this whole time. Finally. Getting somewhere. Alright, now I just got to solve this little puzzle here. And then push it over. And then push this whole thing over. Wait, not that way. This way. Yeah. We completed Forest Plus. I think I'm just going to leave it here then. We're going to head on to the mountains. And that will be my next challenge in Room to Grow.